Stacey Duncan. She's gonna turn a whole family into millionaires. She'll have a fashion line, a foundation. You were incredible today. Thank you. I mean, it wasn't even like tennis. It was an entirely different game. Hey, come hang out with us later. Want me to come tuck you in? No, we can just keep talking. How often does this happen? Going after the same girl? Not as often as you think. We usually have different types. So you're saying I should be flattered? Aren't you everybody's type? Come here. Which one of us? He's not in love with you. What makes you think I want someone to be in love with me? It's nice to see you lit up about something, even if it's my girlfriend. Art's got his coach, Tashi Donaldson, who also is his wife. I'm playing for both of us, Tashi. I think maybe we're disturbed by the fact that she could have been into someone like me. When we were teenagers. When we were teenagers. Hey, I love you. Hello, my name is Michael Morley, and I'm here to review Challenges. Directed by Luca Guggen Gunatino? Or Gunagino? Uh, I hope I got his name right. He was the director of those Timothy Chalamet movies, Call Me By Your Name and Bones and All. This movie is about tennis. It is about Zendaya playing one of the best female tennis players in the world. And she's like one of the best rising tennis players of her time. And she gets involved with two other blokes. <laughs> and you can see what's, what's going on. They get involved into a threesome and you kind of see the drama that's unfolding. She's playing the field. There's one of them that's kind of enjoying it, you know, treating it like just a fling. It's a little piece of meat, something I can play with. And the other one is literally falling in love with her and literally wants to date her and get into a commitment with her. She's like playing the field. But what is so clever about this movie is the tennis sequences are phenomenal. This is one of the best tennis sequences I have seen in a long time, actually. And the romance I thought would ruin it, but it actually builds tension and intrigue and dilemma. And this, this love triangle just makes it so much, so fascinating. It's a love triangle involved in tennis. <laughs> It, and it works. And there was another romantic movie that came out about 20 years ago that was like a tennis movie that had romance in it, and that was Wimbledon. And I actually thought that was a really good movie. And i got to say, the performances are really good. The two actors in the movie are phenomenal. They're great. You can tell that they're going to go off and become very, very good actors. they they got a very good future. And Zendaya, she's rocking it. This is probably the most grounded adult performance I've seen her play. She's always been playing these teenage roles, these young adult roles. Now in this one, she's really playing... She is a young adult star, but it goes from back and forth. It goes from the past and the future. And she does... It, this is the first time I've seen her play an actual woman. And she... it go. It, you kind of have to keep... Some of the flashback sequences, you have to sort of know when it's a flashback sequence and when it goes into the future, because it does go back and forth a bit. There are certain sequences like... The way these characters are, I just can't see this happening in real life with these two blokes getting involved with her in this way. I keep saying to myself, Michael, it's a movie. It's a movie. You gotta just tell yourself that. And that's why I say, okay, it's a movie. It's not real. It's, you know, this would never happen. But what they do really cleverly is that I thought I would start siding with one character in this movie with one of the guys, but it kind of, the movie does this clever thing where you side with either character. You side with this guy, or then you side with the other guy. You kind of go back and forth because it's like this he said, she said, he said story, and you kind of understand from their point of view that they have their own story to tell, they have their own view and opinion, and you kind of see it and go, yeah, I, I understand, I agree, I agree, I agree. Now, I'm not really into tennis movies, but I was really engaged in this movie, and I highly, highly recommend this movie. 9 out of 10. I know. Thank you. You don't know what tennis is. It's a relationship. We went somewhere really beautiful together. Let's go! I'm taking such good care of my little white boys. 
I assume you planned this? Not this part. 